The cosmic neutrino background CNB, C nu B is the universe's background particle radiation composed of neutrinos. They are sometimes known as relic neutrinos. The C nu B is a relic of the Big Bang, while the cosmic microwave background radiation CMB dates from when the universe was 379,000 years old. The C nu B decoupled separated from matter when the universe was just one second old. It is estimated that today, the C nu B has a temperature of roughly 1.95 K. As neutrinos rarely interact with matter, these neutrinos still exist today. They have a very low energy, around 10-4 to 10-6 electron volts. Even high-energy neutrinos are notoriously difficult to detect, and the C nu B has energies around 10-10 times smaller, so the C nu B may not be directly observed in detail for many years, if at all. However, Big Bang cosmology makes many predictions about the C nu B, and there is very strong indirect evidence that the C nu B exists. Topic: <laughs> Derivation of the C nu B temperature. Given the temperature of the CMB, the temperature of the C nu B can be estimated. Before neutrinos decoupled from the rest of matter, the universe primarily consisted of neutrinos, electrons, positrons, and photons, all in thermal equilibrium with each other. Once the temperature dropped to approximately 2.5 MeV, the neutrinos decoupled from the rest of matter. Despite this decoupling, neutrinos and photons remained at the same temperature as the universe expanded. However, when the temperature dropped below the mass of the electron, most electrons and positrons annihilated, transferring their heat and entropy to photons, and thus increasing the temperature of the photons. So the ratio of the temperature of the photons before and after the electron-positron annihilation is the same as the ratio of the temperature of the neutrinos and the photons today. To find this ratio, we assume that the entropy of the universe was approximately conserved by the electron-positron annihilation. Then using Sigma G T three display style sigma propto G T caret three, where sigma is the entropy, G is the effective degrees of freedom, and T is the temperature. We find that G zero G one one three equals T one T Zero display style left frac g underscore zero g underscore one right caret frac one three equals frac t underscore one t underscore zero, where t zero denotes the temperature before the electron positron annihilation and t one denotes after. The factor g zero is determined by the particle species. 2 for photons, since they are massless bosons 2 times 7 eighths each for electrons and positrons, since they are fermions, G1 is just 2 for photons. So T nu T gamma equals 2 2 plus 2 times 7 8 plus 2 times 7 8 1 3 equals 4 11 1 3 Display style FRAC T underscore new T underscore gamma equals left FRAC two two plus two times seven eighths plus two times seven eighths right carrot FRAC one three equals left FRAC four eleven right carrot FRAC one three Given the current value of T gamma equals two point seven two five K, it follows that T nu approximately equals one point nine five K the above discussion is valid for massless neutrinos, which are always relativistic. For neutrinos with a non-zero rest mass, the description in terms of a temperature is no longer appropriate after they become non-relativistic, i.e., when their thermal energy 3 halves kT nu falls below the rest mass energy m nu c2. Instead, in this case one should rather track their energy density, which remains well defined. Topic. Indirect evidence for the C nu B 
Relativistic neutrinos contribute to the radiation energy density of the universe Rho R, typically parameterized in terms of the effective number of neutrino species n nu Rho R equals pi 2 15 T gamma 4 1 plus Z 4 1 plus 7 8 n nu 4 11 4 3 Display style row underscore r equals frac pi caret two fifteen t underscore gamma caret four one plus z caret four left one plus frac seven eight and underscore new left frac four eleven right caret frac four three right, where z denotes the redshift. The first term in the square brackets is due to the CMB. The second comes from the C nu b. The standard model with its three neutrino species predicts a value of n nu 3.046, including a small correction caused by a non-thermal distortion of the spectra during E plus E minus annihilation. The radiation density had a major impact on various physical processes in the early universe, leaving potentially detectable imprints on measurable quantities, thus allowing us to infer the value of n nu from observations. Topic. Big Bang nucleosynthesis Due to its effect on the expansion rate of the universe during Big Bang nucleosynthesis BBN, the theoretical expectations for the primordial abundances of light elements depend on n nu. Astrophysical measurements of the primordial 4 He and 2D abundances lead to a value of n nu equals 3.14 plus 0 0.70 minus 0 0.65 at 68% C, L, in very good agreement with the standard model expectation. equals topic CMB anisotropies and structure formation topic the presence of the C nu b affects the evolution of CMB anisotropies as well as the growth of matter perturbations in two ways, due to its contribution to the radiation density of the universe which determines for instance the time of matter radiation equality, and due to the neutrinos anisotropic stress which dampens the acoustic oscillations of the spectra. Additionally, free-streaming massive neutrinos suppress the growth of structure on small scales. The WMAP spacecraft's five-year data combined with type Ia supernova data and information about the baryon acoustic oscillation scale yielded n nu 4.34 plus 0.88 minus 0.86 at 68% C, L, providing an independent confirmation of the BBN constraints. The Planck spacecraft collaboration has published the tightest bound to date on the effective number of neutrino species, at n nu. equals 3.15 plus or minus 0 0.23. Equals Topic. Indirect evidence from phase changes to the cosmic microwave background CMB. Equals Big Bang cosmology makes many predictions about the C nu b, and there is very strong indirect evidence that the cosmic neutrino background exists, both from Big Bang nucleosynthesis predictions of the helium abundance, and from anisotropies in the cosmic microwave background. One of these predictions is that neutrinos will have left a subtle imprint on the cosmic microwave background CMB. It is well known that the CMB has irregularities. Some of the CMB fluctuations were roughly regularly spaced, because of the effect of baryon acoustic oscillation. In theory, the decoupled neutrinos should have had a very slight effect on the phase of the various CMB fluctuations. In 2015, it was reported that such shifts had been detected in the CMB. Moreover the fluctuations corresponded to neutrinos of almost exactly the temperature predicted by Big Bang theory 1.96 plus or minus 0.02 K compared to a prediction of 1.95 K, and exactly three types of neutrino, the same number of neutrino flavors currently predicted by the standard model.
equals topic prospects for the direct detection of the cnu b equals confirmation of the existence of these relic neutrinos may only be possible by directly detecting them using experiments on earth this will be difficult as the neutrinos which make up the cnu b are non-relativistic in addition to interacting only weakly with normal matter and so any effect they have in a detector will be hard to identify one proposed method of direct detection of the C nu b is to use capture of cosmic relic neutrinos on tritium ie 3 h display style caret 3 mathrm h leading to an induced form of beta decay the neutrinos of the C nu b would lead to the production of electrons via the reaction nu plus 3 h 3 h E plus E minus display style new plus carrot three mathrm h right arrow carrot three mathrm he plus E carrot. While the main background comes from electrons produced via natural beta decay, three H three H E plus E minus plus new Display style carrot three mathrm h right arrow carrot three mathrm he plus e carrot plus bar nu. These electrons would be detected by the experimental apparatus in order to measure the size of the C nu b. The latter source of electrons is far more numerous. However, their maximum energy is smaller than the average energy of the C nu b electrons by twice the average neutrino mass. Since this mass is tiny, of the order of a few EVs or less, such a detector must have an excellent energy resolution in order to separate the signal from the background. One such proposed experiment is called Ptolemy, which will be made up of 100 grams of tritium target. As of 2016 Ptolemy prototype is being built. See also Cosmic background radiation Gravitational wave background Dark matter Diffuse supernova neutrino background Notes Caret nu is the Greek letter nu, standardized symbol for neutrinos. <laughs>